Hello guys, and welcome to a different video. Um, as you could tell, um, my account did get hacked, and uh, um, the hacker had posted some videos, um, but due to you guys uh, reporting the problem, the uh, channel did get taken down, and um, the hacker was no longer able to do anything or cause any more issues. Now luckily, I didn't actually lose anything from the hack. So as we can see here, I still have all of my channels. I can still see all of your comments. Nothing really changed. I still have access to everything. But basically what happened is um, I opened an email from what I believed to have been a sponsor. I, I opened it. I grabbed their download that they sent me that was like, hey, here is a contract, sign it. Um, you're gonna have to unzip this file. Uh, you download it, unzip the file, and you know, click on this thing. Um, now the command or the uh, thing that they wanted me to, you know, execute was a screensaver file, which basically is an executable command that puts a um, virus onto your computer. And uh, through that, I ended up getting hacked. Very silly mistake. Don't trust people unless you know it's from a reliable source. Now, I thought it was because of the way that they linked to specific social medias and stuff like that. It seemed very legit. But in all reality, why in the heck would Stray be wanting to sponsor a Yu-Gi-Oh! channel or Sons of the Forest or something like that, right? Like, it doesn't really make sense. Um, so, yeah, I will be much more attentive when it comes to that and making sure that the emails and the uh, sponsorship deals and all of that stuff are better. But that's not the whole story. So let me give you a quick rundown. On Thursday, my account gets hacked. On Friday, I finally figure out, hey, this is what the line of work that I should do to get my uh, channel back and I start the process. On Saturday, I get very sick, just stuff coming out both ends, not feeling good, and I can't really do anything. And on Friday, my dad goes to the hospital. Now, if you don't know, clear back in 2020, my dad had a had brain surgery, and it, there was a massive complication with the brain surgery, and he ended up, um, I mean, his heart stopped for a total of six minutes, throughout a couple of days, and uh, he was able to finally recover, but he was never really the same. And um, he's had health issues the past three years, because uh, that was at the beginning of 2020 in January. My 2020 was not good. Um, but uh, I'm sure you already know where this is going, given the title and the thumbnail, but yes, my dad did die. Um, sorry. <clears throat> and yeah, um, so that's where I've been. Um, I finally got my account back yesterday at midnight, and uh, or at least yesterday of, as of when you're seeing this, at midnight. Um, I finally got my channel back uh, with, with all of the content and everything um, still intact. Luckily, they didn't change anything. Uh, I just had to go in, you know, set up two-factor, uh, set up, you know, all of that stuff, and, um, and, and just re-secure myself. But, um, yeah, so currently uh, I now have to help my mom and help my family uh, plan a funeral, so that's fun. However, I do want to say uh, a few things before I end this video. Just, first of all, thank you guys so much for the support. We made it to 10,000 subscribers, um, and that was great. Uh, my dad was able to see that. Sorry. My dad was able to see that. I had, I had done that, and, uh, and that was great. Sorry. Um, I don't want to cry, because it makes me, it feels like a fake YouTuber. Uh, I'm sorry. But, um, uh, the second thing is, thank you to the hacker for being dumb, and just not knowing how to truly ruin my life because, um, or just being kind for, for not ruining my life. 
Um, they could have done so much more, and they didn't, and that was great. Um, they did they did steal my Steam account, which was funny, but they didn't actually do anything with it. Uh, so there's that. <clears throat> and um, if you want to support me, the best way to support me is going to be down below. I am going to start a um, a Kickstarter, or not a Kickstarter, a, a GoFundMe, sorry. A GoFundMe to help with the funeral costs and to help just with my mom, seeing as how she didn't work. That was uh, my dad's job, and we kind of lived off of his social security and stuff like that. Um, and so uh, the GoFundMe is to help her get through this until she can get back onto her feet. Um, I will also be doing a charity live stream after the funeral um, at some point to, uh, again, assist with that. So, yeah, that's all. Uh, again, thank you guys so much for the support. And uh, I'm going to be taking a break for a while, obviously. But um, I'll be back soon. Anyway, remember to always stay frosty. Bye-bye.